Baseball is a beautiful sport. In my opinion, the best sport on earth. But there are just some things that people do that just grind my gears. Some things that just push my buttons. And that's why I'm making this video. Here is a list of my worst baseball pet peeves. Enjoy. The first pet peeve that I wanna talk about is when somebody steals your sunflower seeds. Hey Jim, watch my seats. Make sure no one gets them while I'm up to bat. I got you, don't worry about it, I got you. You go up to hit, you've got a full bag of sunflower seeds waiting for you back in the dugout. You come back after you struck out, the last thing you wanna see is an empty bag. This next one I'm gonna talk about is probably one of the most aggravating pet peeves to me. As an infielder, you make a good play, you get an out, you let the outfield know, one out. One out outfield! One out! What is this guy's problem? I can hear you, man, loud and clear. But some kids, for no apparent reason, they think they have to shout how many outs there are at the top of their lungs. One out, please at one! Bring it down a notch, man. What, am I not loud enough? Oh, you want some? Yeah, why don't you just bring it out here? You gonna get some, you want some of me? We're gonna do this right now? You for real? What's the problem, bro? It wasn't loud enough for you? I can show you loud. You wanna hear loud? One out, please at so unnecessary, ridiculous. My biggest pet peeve in life is when people chew their food loudly. But in baseball, there's always that one kid that's chewing his gum obnoxiously. What's up, man? <clears throat> How's it going? Want some big league chew? I'm good. If you're in the dugout with your dudes and you're just like, ah, I might punch you in the face. Mm. <laughs> Another pet peeve of mine is that one little league coach that only cares about winning. All right, let's go, boys. Get out there and play your hearts out. Got to make my to-do list for the day. They don't care about their little league players, their little league kids. They don't care about their growth in baseball. All they care about is winning the, the league. They're literally 12-year-olds. Give them a break, coach. All the parents say having fun is the most important thing. False. The only thing that matters in life and in little league is to win baseball games. If you lose, you're a loser. <laughs> Another thing that I despise is when baseball players argue every single call. What? <laughs> what? Get along with this guy. I get it. Some umpires suck, but not every single call is wrong. That wasn't even close. It was right down the middle. Right down the middle. If you had another eye, you'd be a cyclops. I'm getting tired of you arguing every call. You're out of here. I'm out of here? Oh yeah? You're gone. Gone. You're out of here. You are a sorry excuse for an umpire. Oh yeah? Well, you're a sorry excuse for a batter. What? You know what? I'm leaving. I don't want to be here anymore. Here, I'll leave you with this. <laughs> The next pet peeve of mine is the coach's pet. It's that one kid who just sucks up to all the coaches. Just so he can play shortstop and bat third in the lineup. It's the same kid that reminds the teacher every day to give them homework. Everybody hates this kid. Hate is a strong word. I would rather use strongly dislike. The only person I actually hate are the loud gum chewers. Now, I'm gonna get off this fence before I decapitate my nuts. Hey coach, you need someone to do stats for you? I can write the stats. I got it. No, it's all right. I can I can do it. You can uh, focus on the game a little more. Yeah, you want to take? Yeah, thanks. Do you need anything else? Do you want some water? How about a coffee? 
Oh yeah, I can make you a coffee real fast. The espresso machine in the dugout. Oh, you brought that? Yeah, for you, just for you. By the way, yesterday at practice, I cleaned up all the balls. I cleaned up all the gear, put it in the shed, and uh, it's all ready to go for tomorrow. So you think I'm gonna play shortstop next inning? Um. The next pet peeve is the one guy who doesn't help clean up after practice. All right, boys, it's time to clean up. Get all the stuff together. Let's go. We gotta get out of here. Ah, someone else can clean that up. Hey, you guys got this? I'm gonna go home. Unbelievable. So irresponsible. Keep going. Oh. If you're this person, you need to get better at life. The next thing I want to talk about that annoys the heck out of me is when somebody gets on first base and they think they have to clap. You know when you're in Little League and there's always this one kid that shows up with an oversized cup? <laughs> but you're always like trying to like make sure you don't stare at his crotch, but it's just like there. All right, here we go, boys. <laughs> All right, boys, here we go, boys. He's usually the guy that's like super cocky and thinks he's a hot shot, but in reality, he's only compensating and he's wearing his dad's athletic cup. I don't know why his dad has a cup, but. <laughs> what are you zooming in on? Your crotch. <laughs> hey, 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 eyes, eyes right here, eyes right here, hey! Hey! Eyes above the prize. Hey! Yo! Oh. It's honestly not that annoying, it's just kind of funny. It's on the line of like maybe pet peeve, but more so just hysterical. Another Little League pet peeve of mine is when a kid wears his socks over his baseball pants. Like, what are you doing? This next one I'm gonna talk about is terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Terrible, terrible, awful, terrible. Unbelievably terrible. I don't know what other adjective to use other than, it's terribly terrible, that's what it is. You show up to a game, you got nice new gear, you got a new bat you're ready to hit a dinger with. What's up, man? How you doing? Hey, so uh, I uh, left my stuff at home. Mind if I use your bat? Just one time, just one time. And what are you gonna say? You're gonna give me your bat because it's the right thing to do. Promise you take care of it. Yeah, I'll take care of it. Right, it's a $400 bat. $400? Yeah. Oh yeah, no, I'll take care of it. Oh, oh actually, everything. do you mind if I borrow this next inning too? What? You don't even play first base. Let me use your bat. Can I use your helmet? After you're done chewing that gum, do you mind if I get a chew? I mean, at this point, you might as well just take the whole bag. Hey, that's not a bad idea. Go ahead. I, mean, yeah, I feel I, like you're going to do hey, that. Hey, no anyway. worries. Yeah, hey, I really appreciate it though. You want my cup as well? Yeah. You want me grab that out? Yeah, I, I, actually, you can keep that. <laughs> I don't know what number pet peeve we're on. Like, 86? There's a lot of baseball pet peeves. There's always one kid who ate some chicken fajitas the night before, and he just explodes the dugout. <coughs> you better hope you're playing that game, because if you're on the bench with that kid next to you, say goodbye to your sense of smell. He literally rips one from center field, and the catcher will drop dead. Dude, it was that Taco Bell last night. Uh, so good coming in, but not coming out. <laughs> There's always that one kid who takes forever to get in the batter's box. Forever. <laughs> yeah, give me one sec. I gotta play the whole Jingle Bells soundtrack before I get up to bat. It's just my routine. All right, I'm ready. The last pet peeve of mine is uh, when someone can't focus on the baseball game. I pity that kid. He's got a beautiful game right in front of him 
and he's too worried about whatever else he's worried about. He's worried about the girls in the stands, what he's having for dinner later. But the last thing he's worried about is going up to bat. And when he does go up to bat, he strikes out, comes back in the dugout, sits down, and starts talking about Fortnite. That's all I have to say. Thank you for watching. That was my worst pet peeves, and uh, hope you enjoyed. Check one, two. Baseball is a wonderful sport. In my opinion, the best sport in the world. Let's do that again. Baseball is a beautiful sport. Sport. Baseball is a beautiful sport. I, I forgot what I was gonna say. There's just something about it. Nah, frick it. Little behind the scenes here. What's going on, Troy? The next pet peeve of mine. <laughs> oh, the next pet peeve of mine. 